Hello everyone, I'm Brazilian Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Victoria 2, playing as Brazil. So, last time, we didn't do a whole ton, but we have been reforming ourselves to be better, 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 lowering our infamy, and at the end of last episode, we became led, or we are currently led now, by the Liberal Party, which really hurts our economic policy. Policy. So, a couple comments. First of all, I didn't realize you could store research for a year, up to a year. So that's good to know. Thank you for letting me know about that. Secondly, um, apparently in HFM, it doesn't allow you to change parties Oh, willy-nilly. I just can't click on these guys. So, <sighs> that's good to know as well. And, frankly, you know what? I kind of don't mind being socialist Brazil, like I said last time, or reactionary Brazil. At this point, though, <sighs> ooh, that's pretty tough. 23, 26... I still want reforms. If we go socialist, we can still do reforms, which is a good thing. But right now, oh my gosh, the money, because we can tax people only up to 50%. It's not the time to be this type of liberal party, man. It's just not. <laughs> it's just not, man. But that is what it is. But because of that, I might use console commands just to influence a few things here and there, just because it's going to get really tough. Like, I won't be able to do almost anything if we don't have to get more population, if I can't, you know, uh, raise taxes to afford more things. So, I might do something here and there just to make sure that it still goes okay, because HFM, it's a special mod, but regardless. Uh, one of the comment was for me to annex the cone, like Chile, Argentina, Paraguay, Bolivia, which that's my goal in the end, to be able to do that. But I need more population, and I can encourage soldier pops, but that costs more money, and I already have, like, no money. Like, this is ridiculous. This is really bad. I want to tax, or, you know, spend as much money on education as possible, but I'm limited. I already raised my tariffs to 25%. I'm still losing money. Oh, my goodness. This is so bad. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to interfere in this, because I'm not going to deal with this party. So, uh, you know what, actually, what's the, what's the, what's the other liberal party like? So, we have... The Karoka. Not just a regular. Ooh, intervention. Why is that one not selected? Instead of this one. Is it the more modern Liberal Party? I definitely don't want this one. So, what if we just have another election right now? I mean, we're 13th in the world, which isn't bad, but... I would like... Oh, my goodness. La Paz has got a lot of guys there. A lot of craftsmen. Uh, that's not good. You guys are doing that. That's fine. Uh, Intellectual-wise, you are done. Sao Paulo is done. Good. You guys, intellectuals, you're done at Minas Gerais. Cool. Nordesta. You're done as well? Great. And then La Paz. Intellectuals. Good. As many intellectuals as it takes. <clears throat> Alright, so we're making just a barely any money. I did not want to get, you know, I don't want to take out loans. So there's no leftist bias. At this point, yeah, just, we're going to go socialist. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, God. What, UK, what are you doing? The, oh, God. The Franco Prussian War. You, they just got out of war against the Kingdom of Italy. And they lost, I thought. Oh, God, that is... That is gonna be... Oh, God. The Great Eastern Crisis. Spain? Why is Spain in there with the Ottomans versus Serbia, Romania, Montenegro, Bulgaria, Spain, the Russian... Oh, my goodness. But you know what? That's great for us. Uh, there's one faith and one faith only. I'm gonna go with that, so because I like that one. Why are we getting no immigrants? Wait, seriously, why are we getting no immigrants? You know, this party is... Oh my goodness, it's just not good. Mm. Yeah, that makes no sense. Now we're getting a little bit more, which is good. And America always gets a lot, but... Mm. Come on, people, leave Europe. It's on fire. Uh, Sure? Sure? Getting a little bit more what's going on here. Expand war. French... Oh my god, French Madras. Wait. France is getting... Immigrants from Germany 
And the UK? Um. Okay. I mean, usually people don't immigrate to other European countries. Like, oh my goodness. Is this just a part of the mod? How is Austria-Hungary getting immigrants? Most people want to leave Austria-Hungary. They don't want to go to Austria-Hungary. Oh, what is this? Oh, what is, oh, 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 what is that? What is that? What is that? Okay, so it's... Oh, that's a really good one. The Treaty of Frankfurt. End of the Franco-German War. And the German Empire's here. Oh, that's a nice little shade of gray. You know what? Just in case, you know... They're getting more and more powerful. It's probably good to keep... Good to keep good relations with them. Battle Rio. Huh. Well, we're 12th in the world now. We're still trying to expand our education services, but... Full citizenship, that's good. Ooh. Pluralities, that's, well, that's okay. Uh, I'm going to keep holding elections because we can. Uh, minimum wage, suffrage. Ah, just suppress them all. An old, tired soldier. I can incur acceptable pensions. Acceptable minimum wage. I uh, prefer no reforms at all. That's good. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. I want more social reform desire. Be good, but god dang it. This party is going to be the death of me. <clears throat> Upper house. Ideologies. 37% are liberal, which is fine, but they're the wrong type of liberals. Oh, 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 Ottomans. Oh my goodness, you're getting smacked down by them. To war by Jingo, yes, the first. Japanese invented communism. Hmm. Hmm. Empire of Japan. The beer hall opening, cheers. Oh, sure, why not? I suppose, why not? But how do you get more money? What? What's going on now? National stockpile purchases. I mean, I am trying to stockpile more things, which is kind of hurting me. So, I'm not sure which one we're buying. You can do that. It's probably not coal, though. Factories need... They need a lot. Ooh. Good, give them full citizenship, that would be good. Whew, that is a Germany. That is definitely a Germany. And the Kingdom of France is looking pretty weak. Arpeton. Of course, that's normally French. Breton. Oh, yeah, that's Brittany over there. We got Picardy, maybe, perhaps. Full citizenship. That'd be good. We're 12th in the world still. Six industrial score. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really matter if we keep doing it or not, so. Oh, someone is trying to expand. Okay, they're trying to expand a little bit. That's okay-ish. Ooh, new political party. A party. What is a communist like? Now, if I turn communist, I can build factories. We're pro-military. We're full citizenship. We're, we like atheism. We get protectionism as well. And paternalistic spending. If that's the case... It... <sighs> That might be okay. Protectionism, whatever. Just because... Uh, that might not be okay, actually. Just because people don't like communists, and we might get a, go to war with a lot of people that are communists. So, we'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to fix this, or work with this a little bit. Just so I can go to war with these guys. Oh god, the Spanish Republic over here. What the heck? Huh. One faith, one faith only. I always like doing that. Action and reaction. Motion carries. Uh, I mean, it really doesn't matter in the upper house. It's going to change anyway, so. Serb restoration to the order of Bosnian provinces. Oh, Bosnia's here. Oh! The Ottoman Empire has been... Oh, who owns... Russia owns Thrace. And they own Zagreb. How great. Oh, machine guns. Oh, actually. Colonize these areas. We need revolution and counter-revolution. Yeah. Which we can't unlock, so I guess we'll go with that one next. 
liberal anarcho liberals yeah no matter what I do doesn't seem like we'll ever be able to get out of this party free trade is not good trade for us right now beer halls yep I can make another division I suppose I need a horse guy oof Playing Brazil is tough. America still haven't done gas and purchase. Austria Hungary. Serbia's looking pretty big. Definitely bigger than what they were historically. Wow, that looks that's a lot of Bosniak Serbs. Cro oh god. Yeah, they might form Yugoslavia eventually. The Brazilian Red Star. Uh you know what? All Porsche Rada, all Porsche Rada. Give me the Porsche Rada. 36% of the vote. Full citizenship. Hmm, see what we can do about that. Ottomans are not looking good whatsoever. A chic dumb. Netherlands. Albania's here too. Oh, and there's Montenegro. More prestige, nice. And we still want to keep colonizing. Ooh, Patriots are going to fight for our country. Yeah. How do we get colonial nation? Um, well, we can't really get it right now. Let's see, over here. Yeah, whatever. Reach loaded rifles. Colonial negotiations. So, oh, it has to be 1880. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. So we, we need to invent machine guns. Economic responsibility, naval logistics. Okay. Okay, not bad. Ideology is pretty reactionary down there. Let's see, what else? What else we got? Rio, that's okay. Less reactionary, less anarcho liberal support, okay. Hmm. A little bit more communist support. So that's what the parties look like now. 25%, 36%. Hmm. And when can we do another reform? 41% of the house. Well, I need more militancy then. Militancy and consciousness. This Austro-Hungarian liberation of Vojvodina uh, gets the Russians not doing so well. Japan will increase relations with you, I suppose. Russia doesn't really matter to me too much. UK, America, well, I guess we could do it anyways. Keep. I will go to maybe war with Chile eventually, hopefully, but we'll see what happens. Keep good relations with the Peruvians. Honest, effective administration. Yes. Cool. Come on, keep increasing that. This really sucks. Yeah, this is really not good. Just a little bit less. I don't want to have so much of this. Cool. That's good. Machine guns would be good to get as well. But revolution and counter-revolution is kind of where it's at. Cool. And we don't have enough population <clears throat> to get another national focus just yet. New political party. Palista. Uh, oh, this is a good conservative party. Oh, that's not too bad. We got state capitalism, which I like. We got pluralism, which is okay. Full citizenship. Oh, my goodness. You guys are doing work. You guys are doing work. Let's see. Three and a half percent, two and a half. Cool. Three, three point eight. That's not bad. How's immigration going? It's not bad. We're really getting nobody though. God dang. Vice multiculturalism. They almost get two thousand. How does Ecuador get more than me? Close down the bars. Close down the bars. Screw it. Do it. Hmm. I think I'm just getting unlucky a little bit. People even. Yeah, they're leaving. Canada exists as well. Need some clerks, too. How's Asia looking? Oh, actually, did it? I thought the... The UK owned the Suez. Well, at this point, we're probably going to go socialist. 
even though that reactionary party or the conservative party would have been really nice to have, I think that's probably the best way for us forward. Mm, I doubt we'll, we could win. I'm going to do it anyways for funsies. Constant elections every year. As soon as the guy gets into office, the, you know, the prime minister, or the leader's like, yeah, I don't really like this. <laughs> All right, let's look at uh, politics. Do we have movements? Uh, just suppress everybody. There's, we have no rebels. Oh, now we do. Do that. Yeah, we have. Huh. Likely to be more rebellious. Put him down. Hmm. All right, South Indian Patriots. Now we're good. Brazilian trade policy, protectionism. That's fine. Whatever. We almost gotten rid of all of our infamy, which is great. But this really sucks. So our military school. We have 24 soldiers. I want to go to war with these guys. Hmm. You know what? I want to at least do something. Can we at least annex them, maybe? No, I'm going to acquire... Oh my god, that's pretty bad. You know what? We're going to do that. Screw it. I want to at least go to war and do something. And the only state we'll be able to annex would just take is Mato Grosso, which really sucks. But it's better to do it now and instead of doing it later. So chimney sweepers, child labor restricted. Sure. Why not? 46%. Almost 40%. I mean, we're basically not getting almost any immigrants anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Yeah, they really like going to Ecuador. That's... How did... What, why? Why? What does Ecuador have that we don't? Hmm. Do I have any other decisions I could take? And eh, we got found out, whatever. Doesn't really matter. Suppression Act, Life in the New World. Oh, I need money. Who gives a hoot about the religion, anyways? Right. Oh, God. Oh, Austria Hungary is. Oh, they're not doing well. Oh, they're fighting. Ooh, the Italians is. Ooh. That's so bad. This is one of the worst parties I've ever seen. Can I just turn socialist? Please, let me turn socialist. Screw the Liberal Party. I want to go full socialist now. Uh, what are you talking about? Good. Well, at least that's good. We did this. Social science would probably be pretty good. We need to get some collectivist theory, perhaps? Inorganic chemistry, maybe? It might be okay. It gives us population growth. Cool. Oh, yeah, they got a backseat. That's weird. Cool, cool. War justification still going. That's fine. Uh, you guys. Does America want alliance? Probably not. Yeah, that's what I thought. Japan, probably good to increase relations with them. Nice, very nice. Moralism, sure, why not? Mission to Bolivia. Alright, so we can go to war for that state, and I'll be right back, because I want to edit a few things first. Alright, my friends, sorry about that, but here we are. So, basically, unfortunately, I have to use Khan's commands to get out of this little bad period, because we're doing nothing. We're, I mean, we're educating our populace. We're, we might be getting a few more people, growing our population a little bit, but... This party is killing me here. I'm Right now, in 1870, you definitely don't want laissez-faire, and there's nothing I can do about it. I can't get more socialists, obviously I can't get more conservatives, so basically we're going to have to rest restoration of the monarchy. Your Majesty, on account of the unstable parliamentary situation, we see no other option than to declare a restoration to the crown to the principles of absolute monarchy. These principles and documents of Brazilian constitutionalism are effective immediately, declared null and void, long live the king. And the reason we did that, we're still in absolute monarchy, which is cool, 
I like the Monarchs. We still believe in equality, but now I can actually switch parties. I didn't know this. It just, what was it, constitutional or semi-constitutional monarchies? You can't change parties, which I think is a big old no-no. But since we can change it, I'm going to go come here. And I might, if they switch parties again and the people can vote, uh, which obviously they can, I'm just going to switch parties every time because this is most important. And maybe I'll emphasize conservative parties because that's, that's pretty much what we want the entire game. Unless we like flip this communism or like fascism later on. But I'm thinking we might want to stick with that. But come on. And we want to go to buy go to war by like end of April. As well. Tax them. Tax the hell out of them. I need money. We need money. I wanna to go to war. Alright, so we get a little bit more money. We do that as well. Rebel communist rebel organization gain good. Uh, I do want to go to war with these guys. We can go to war. They're allied with Argentina and Peru, which isn't good. So let's get another great power ally. I'm pretty sure they're the British. They still like us. Cool. Nice. Are we getting any sort of... Oh, people are emigrating from our country. Oh. That's interesting. So they don't. They no longer want to come to Brazil. Just because we become, you know, a conservative party. We're an absolute monarchy again. Or we become a limited constitutionalism semi-constitutional monarchy, which is, uh, now I probably can't select this, probably now, but hey, if we stay at this party, hopefully that'll be okay, I don't know, this is definitely turning interesting, uh, hey, but we're still losing people, still losing people, oh, what was that, uh, protection status, you know what, we get these little groups as accepted cultures, which is fine, actually, that gives us more population too, so, we'll do the protection status, which is fine, I can not edit this at all, which is really actually not ideal, but that's just because we have no money. Hmm. That sucks. We have no money. But we want to go to war regardless. But now we get another focus, which is actually kind of good. So I'm going to go ahead. Where do our focuses set at? For you guys, I'm going to set you guys just to go to conservative. Like, for now. Like, please keep this party in power. For the love of God, please keep the party in power. And our infamy is looking pretty darn good. Ooh. They have zero score. You guys have five. My military isn't looking great. Oh, can we build? Yeah. That'd be good. Oh, we don't need a Hussar. We need a artillery piece. Or a guard. Or engineer. Actually, let's get an engineer. Go to war by June. That'd be good. Alright, not too bad. I mean, I hate using cons commands and campaigns. Sometimes it's a necessary evil. Really sucks. Really sucks. But at least we're making money. A little bit of money now. Uh, actually. Alright, cool. We got stuff going on. We got someone trying to build a liquor distillery. The Heart of Darkness. Cool. The Empire of Brazil apologizes for nothing except full responsibility. Oh, God. I lose 20 prestige. That's not good. I can't do this because we need more money. So. <clears throat> and they need jobs. Rio is... Trying to get a factory too. Explosives. I don't think explosives are worth that much, are they? Yeah, their demand's kind of going down. I'm not going to do that though. Make Rio more populous. Popular. Doesn't hurt our budget too much right now, so that's not too bad. War exhaustion, good. Well, not good, obviously. Because those guys. Did we just create another unit? Oh, that's still coming. It's still coming. That's good. Whew. We're doing okay now. We're doing definitely okay-ish. Upper house rearrange. That's fine. Just don't vote up my party. Good. Good. Oh! Choose a trade policy. Good. Uh, that's fine. Yeah. Keep it flexible. It's fine with me. Oh, we're making some serious money now. Oh, thank God. Ugh. I was, I just, I don't mind end game, laissez faire, land game stuff, but just, you know, earlier on in, in the middle game, you just can't afford that. It's just not worth it. Got more supply limit. Uh, it'd probably be good to get more military stuff, so let's go with this one. Morale is pretty good. Tactics are very good as well. As well. That's probably the most important one. Let's see, get these guys, get over there. This army isn't looking great. I'm going to acquire a state. Now, if, hmm, let me call my allies. Let's see what happens. 
So, UK, Venezuela said no, Paraguay said no, Ecuador said no, but Chile said yes. So now we're fighting all these guys. But we do have the UK on our side, so we'll see what happens. I don't really know what's going to happen. It's going to be fairly difficult. Ecuador, uh, sure. This might be a bad idea. This might be a very bad idea. But hopefully the UK gets involved here. For the love of God, I hope they do. Alright. Uh, you know what? You said no to me. But I'll continue to do it because I might be able to use you later. Take the capital if we can, maybe. That's not going to be good for us. That's okay. At least give me some sort of war action, you know. Some sort of conflict here. Could mobilize. They have a lot of... Oh, they must be mobilizing or something. That's a lot of guys. Um, can't call them in. Oh, we're not the leader of the war. Oh, France is looking pretty bad. Alright, so if I... Hmm. Oh, they've got 20,000 guys there. That's not good. Hey, but the UK has kind of showed up already. Do they have anything moving down here? It's not going great for us, but we'll see what happens. Nice, we took the capital. Must not get hit with the war leader. So be it. Uh, UK, please get down here. I could really use your help. Wait, Bulgaria? What the heck are you doing down here? That cuts in the budget a little bit. That's okay, though. So I need to blockade these enemy ports. That's a lot of guys down there. That's a lot of guys up here, too. Hmm. And blockade them. Good. Rhetoric of hate. Interesting, interesting. Cool, let's beat them up some more. And go for Peru. We might be able to siege up Peru eventually. 18th and 3. 3, 12,000, 12,000. They focus a lot of our on our infantry. Hmm. Then a jungle, which gives them more defense. So we pretty much took out all of Bolivia. I can't peace out with them yet. Because we're not doing that well. French expedition to Korea? Wow, that's weird. Mm, if I attack, it's probably not going to go very well for us. So... You know what, Argentina's... I'm going to save, save them for last, probably. Probably. Oh, we can build another... Oh, my goodness. We can build four more things. So, we have five, two... Let's get one infantry, two artillery. That'd be good. You know, we're already pretty much kind of stacked out. But whatever. Uh, do I should attack there? Hmm. What's my general like? He's gonna attack. Hmm, this is my only army. I don't want to really risk it. Cool. Increase relations with them. That'd be fine. Oh! Did these guys peace out? Or, what? Wait, no they didn't. What's going on? Oh, they must... Oh, they just fully see just that, so I can't see it anymore. That makes sense. That's okay. You know? Wait, peace? Okay, well, you know, that could have been worse. All we got was this little sliver, which is fine, whatever. That gives us time to focus on other stuff with our army, which is okay with me. Because right now, we want to take that. So next time we go to war with those guys, we will fully be able to take out Bolivia. We have found out who our true allies are. Venezuela, you're in a god dang American sphere. Ugh. Oh, oh, I see. They immediately said no when the British showed up. Thank you, Britain. At this point, if people don't, really don't want to emigrate to Brazil, then there's no point for me to not go to war with people. So, that being said, you guys are going to come with me, and we're going to make you all big and buff. I'm going to buff them out. And finish off Madagascar. Oh my god, 20? You know what? I've got enough space for that, so... Gotta make some more money, make some more money. We can lower that problem. Uh, well, I do want to go to war with them, so. See what happens. Our props rearranged. I mean, I still want to do reforms, don't get me wrong. I love reforms. And do we get anyone coming to Brazil? No, not really. They don't like monarchies for some reason. They love America, though. Wow. That looks not good for them. Nice. Oh, reforms, good. Let's go ahead and grab Iron Railroad, Culture, Education Efficiency, please. 
voting all allowed good I want more social reforms we need social reforms Argentina's gotta have to get they're gonna have to get beaten up and I can actually invest in roads say it's not so wow I can invest in roads because we make a little bit of money wow that cost us a lot of infamy I'm not sure if that was really worth it or not oh well it is what it is. I'm not going to change that. I already used consequence earlier, so. Oh, yep, yeah, they're coming right for us. How fast can we take them out? Not that quickly. That's okay, though. Roads. Oh, you need a naval base there. That'd be good. Get some roads over there, too. We're 13th in the world. We don't have enough money. Cool. Oh, projects. Yes, people will build. Yeah, we'll do that. It's fine with me. Delegated power, good. I'm gonna get that guy in here hopefully first and then we'll move on. Oh, uh, that is pretty good. Get on the boat. Come down here. Hope you guys are having a great day over. Oh, well, hope you guys are having a good day. I'm doing fairly well myself. Let's see, that's good. Can't really build too many roads here just because we don't have money and there's a lot of hills, mountains, and jungles. Oof. Oh. Transval. Ah, oh, UK. I love you, UK. You know what? Oh. R what? R Romania? How are you over there? How are you all the way on the opposite side of where Romania is? Oh, what happened to Italy? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That does not look good for Italy. I mean, they, they formed, but that looks like they chopped Italy's arms off. It does not look very good. Oh, yes. I love child labor, but, uh... I like more population growth too. Oh, yeah, I'll do that. Oh, Bohemian. Oh my goodness, this is not good for the guys right here. Oh, Bulgaria. Holy crud! You're getting smacked down. The Ottomans are not having it this time. Where are my boats? Oh, there, there they are. How much longer? You might as well go ahead and increase the budget up all the way to max. We'll lose a couple oh, bits of money, but whatever. Spanish Republic, Kingdom of Italy, Serbia is looking pretty... Did they even get Vojvodina? Okay, yeah, makes sense. Vojvodina. Nice. We can straight up annex them. They're not even over here yet. Where are you guys? Taking forever. No. Oh, what's going on? Are they at war? Romanian Liberation... Greek liberation. Argent liber Argentinian liberation of Paraguay and Chaco. See, this is why I told you to come into the war with me, Paraguay, so this wouldn't happen. But you'll probably be okay. Actually, if anything, that they might take stuff away from Argentina, which would be really good. Nice. They don't have... They have 9 military score. They got 12. I have great capabilities here. Could just go immediately go to war. Finish the island off. Don't need to call anyone in. That'd be good. Let our guys heal up a little bit. And you know what? You got guys here, so come up there. No, 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 no. Yeah, no, I'm gonna do that. So uh let's double check. It's probably Okay, we can still get any party that we want, except for the Communist Party, which we don't really care about. Good. Good. Oh, my goodness. I know we're losing money, but yeah, whatever. Good. And these guys really don't have that much to do, but that's okay. Socialism? Oh, no, no, no. I don't want any more socialism. That just sounds like a lot of people we're going to put down eventually. Oh, look at that. Nice. Oh, we can't do any better yet, huh? Oh, we need to invent germ theory, transportation, capital punishment, incarceration. Well, what do the people want? Trinket minimum wage. Well, I don't believe in trinket minimum wage right now. I believe in child labor being restricted. So it helps our education efficiency. The children must learn how to read. Whether they like it or not, we'll beat the, we'll beat the literacy into them. All right. Good. Uh, Japan, sure, why not? Increase relations. It's always good to be on good relations with everyone. Including the Dutch. Including the Dutch. Anyhow, uh, we're probably going to need 
lower our budget expenses just by a little bit for now. Cool, that's not looking good. Don't want to increase that too much. Can't really... Eh, at this point, you can probably lower that by a little bit too. Okay, okay. Nice. Come on down here. You guys can just kind of hang out at the port. Get some sunshine, you know, good stuff like that. Paraguay include demand reparations. You know, Paraguay... You know, you had you had your chance. Oh, Anglo Zulu War. They really had their chance, but they chose not to. Yay! We did it, my friends. Organize Madagascar. Reform local government. Good. And organize Madagascar. Get prestige. Awesome. Set Brazilian to the, to the primary culture. Religion changes to Catholic here. Great. Very good. And we can lower this. We don't want to go to war at any time for now. We want to make much more money so we can spend it on roads and good stuff like that, and education. Mostly education. War's no longer affecting us. Gaza, cool. Good. Now let's return on home, my friends. We had a great victory. So you guys are okay. Oh, guards, I like the guards. Oh, look at this. That, that's disgusting. Can I do this yet? No. We have both of the text research already that's necessary for this stuff. That's okay. If you guys could wall up Argentina hard enough, that would be great. I'm going to need at least two armies. One to take out Argentina, one to take out Peru. That'd actually probably be good. And then once Argentina's done, we'll kill off Chile, probably. Uh, let's see, army stuff. We can wait. Ad hoc. Administrative. Hmm. Throughput stuff, huh? Organic chemistry seems pretty good as well. Market structures, organized factories. Uh, you know, I'll do that. Why not? Argentina's doing pretty well. Paraguay is just straight up not doing well, though. They're the ones not doing well. All right. Can I build any more roads around here, please? Oh, Ottomans are not doing well against... Oh, yeah. The Ottomans are now dying like crazy. Kingdom of France. It's good. Yeah, I want to see what happens here. Austria-Hungary might die, maybe? Maybe not? The Ottomans are going to go kaboom. That's definitely for sure. Oh, my goodness. Good. Uh, do that. Outrage. What? Conservative Party rocked by scandal. God dang it. Conservative Party. Limited citizenship. That's fine. Whatever. Ah, they're back. Good. So you guys have quite a su supply limit. Um... Uh... So you actually are okay. If you get enough soldiers in your group, you'll be fine. So come over here and help, like, put people down in Santa Cruz. And we're going to make another group here. So we got one guard, one artillery. Less conservatives. Which isn't good to see. And we're going to build this where? So one, and then one, and then there. Uh, actually, you could probably build a horse there. That's fine. Two. There you go. Nice. Reforms. Low health care. Getting more consciousness. Getting more of that as well. They're allied with Chile. What happened here? Who won? What? Demand reparations. Okay. They have no military score, and Chile has 13. Hmm. They're allied with Chile. Uh... Form an alliance. I have a decrease relations. Honestly, if I could take them out, that'd be really good first. If you just straight up annex them, that'd be a lot more fun. They're only allied with Peru, which is good. Peru's, even though they're in America's sphere. I'm gonna say no, just so I can see if I can take them out. No, I'd, that'd be taking too long. Oh, they want to accept. Oh, that's okay. I can still use them as a punching bag for now. Good. Get some of those guys. You guys are looking great. We lost a ship, apparently, or something like that. Good. And we're going to go with... Next. Three more... Ah, oh, Colonial Range is pretty good stuff. That's still pretty good, so... Um... Photo processing. Let's go with interchangeable parts. So, we're going to end today's episode there. It has definitely been a roller coaster of things going on, my friends. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, 
consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and we'll see you all tomorrow as we have a great time with Brazil once again. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.